All right, hey guys, what's up? It's that home theater dude. Got a brand new episode for you today. As you can see in front of you, I have both the subs pulled out again. Uh, it seems you guys really enjoyed the last video I did with the PB Ultra. Um, this one has been just doing crazy. Uh, the, it's, it's been doing damage in the house. Uh, we checked out Jurassic World with it. We did a couple of uh, demos with it yesterday. And uh, this thing is a freaking champion. I really enjoy it. It's a freaking monster. Uh, what, and that basically inspired me to actually uh, jump into today's video. So today's video, everyone's been asking me for this video for a really long time. It is uh, Base I Love You. Uh, apparently everyone's been asking about that since I got that guy, the PP4000. And, uh, you know, I, I finally decided to do it. And then I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to top it even further. And I'm going to jump into this other song called Curtain Shaker. I'm not sure if you guys have ever heard it before, but it actually has uh, frequencies down below uh, 15 hertz. So it goes down to like 10 sweeps in between 10 and 15. Uh, bass I Love You, I think it's mainly like a 20 to 15 hertz song. Uh, and then you'll be able to tell that in the actual excursion themselves. Subsonic uh, frequencies are stuff you can't actually hear. So most of us, if we're really good, we can hear below 20, like maybe 19 if we're lucky. Uh, but besides that, you're actually gonna see the woofers, um, you know, ex well, <laughs> they're gonna see the woofers uh, with, with the excursion, but you're actually gonna uh, be able to feel it. Like it'll pulse the room. And things like that you might actually get a little wind on your uh, your legs um, if, if they're in front of you uh, besides that i'm gonna go ahead and jump into the demo real quick and uh, you guys tell me what you think All right, so with uh, that last little clip, I actually changed up whenever I was doing the curtain shaker demo. I actually changed up the um, settings in the SVS subs. I just went in the little, um, you know, the app on the phone, and I changed both of these to extended mode, and then I plugged the center port. As you can see down here, they're all open. I went ahead and changed it already. Um, but you, you know, you have those little uh, three and a half inch ports down here, and you have the variability, and you can actually change it in the app. So you can plug up the center one if you want to put an extended mode and it gives you that lower tuned uh, subsonic type of experience. So if you wanna you really tap the potential of this type of uh, configuration, go ahead and plug that port, put it in extended mode, and then uh, just set it and forget, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, you can also have the option of plugging each individual port and then changing it to sealed mode. But I mean, that basically depends on what you want. So you can do that with both of these, any of the 4,000 lines and the ultra lines, you can actually do that. So. Um, yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and uh, touch base on that. Changed it to extended mode. It's a completely different, well, I'm not gonna say it's completely different, but it, it, it will really open up the full potential of the actual sub itself. Um, besides that, if you guys wanna go ahead and try this stuff, I'll leave links in the description. 
and uh, let me know what you think about everything. So really appreciate you guys for watching. Like I said, like always, you guys like any of this stuff in the house, I have links for everything in the description. You guys want a link for something, hit me up directly. Uh, check out my Facebook channel, check out my, uh, my Instagram, and uh, you know, just leave a comment. I'd like to hear from you guys. All right, check you later.